Welcome back. Much colder weather across the Twin Tiers today. The unofficial high though was actually back at midnight, 33 degrees, but temperatures have been dropping ever since and we've been stuck in the mid teens pretty much all day long. And with these cold temperatures in place, a northwesterly wind, some moisture coming off the Finger Lakes here. You can see a lake Finger Lake enhanced snow shower affecting parts of Tompkins County, including up towards uh, the Ithaca area and then dropping down towards uh, northeastern areas of Tioga County may see uh, minor accumulations of up to an inch within this localized area. But elsewhere, we're looking at scattered clouds and uh, with some breaks in the overcast, that's going to allow temperatures to continue to tumble overnight tonight. Our weather story looking like this. We are calling for the frigid conditions here as we go through uh, the next several hours. In fact, could be near record lows for tonight. The record low six below set just last year. Right now we're forecasting five below, so it's going to be a very close call. Sunshine for our Friday. Temperatures a little bit warmer than today, but that moderating trend will continue through the weekend and definitely next week. Much warmer by the middle of next week, upper 40s to perhaps near 50 degrees for a high temperature. 13 right now in Hornby, 14 in Watkins Glen, 15 in Elmira. Sayre coming in at 14 degrees, 15 in Wellsboro, and only 11 right now in Wellsville, 14 in Hornell. So definitely a cold night tonight. But uh, at least we're not digging out from the snowstorm that they're dealing with over much of the mid-Atlantic region. Areas of southern Pennsylvania, a good 5 to 10 inches of snow. Similar snow amounts coming in uh, across New Jersey and the New York City area. This storm system lifting north and east off the mid-Atlantic coast. So again, not having an impact on our weather. Notice the drier air back to the north and west, and that'll be settling into our region for tonight. So the scattered clouds kind of giving way to a clearing trend here going through the overnight period. Other than these uh, Finger Lake enhanced snow showers, we're going to keep it dry for the overnight period, but bitterly cold again, most ending up well below zero. 15 right now in Elmira, 14 in Rochester, 11 the current temperature in Syracuse. So our 24 hour planner again, very cold tonight, but the nice bright sunny day for tomorrow. High pressure in control. Uh, we'll be looking at high temperatures in the low to mid 20s, 23 our five degree guarantee. Checking out future track now here for the overnight period tonight. No precipitation to worry about. Friday also looking very quiet weather wise. Lots of sunshine and again temperatures on the cold side with highs in the low and mid 20s. Now for tomorrow night clouds start to increase and there'll be a couple of weak clipper systems sliding across southern Canada here as we go through the weekend and that'll bring Occasional cloudy skies our way and a few flurries and light snow showers here and there, but accumulations look minor and will be under an inch. Our five degree guarantee for today, we forecast a high temperature of 28. Again, we were 33. That was the unofficial high back at midnight, but it's been obviously much colder during the daylight hours. Here's a look at our forecast for the northern tier tonight. Scattered clouds, four below in Mansfield. Also forecasting four below in Canton and Sayre, three below in Tawanda. Up into the southern tier, look for frigid conditions overnight tonight. Most spots right around five, six degrees below zero. And up into the southern Finger Lakes, localized snow showers in Tompkins County this evening. Otherwise, just scattered clouds. And again, five to cold as uh, low as 10 below for temperatures tonight. First warning, seven day forecast showing those snow showers Saturday, perhaps a flurry on Sunday. Temperatures both days in the mid 30s. And then as we go into early next week, notice that nice jump in temperatures. 48 is what we're forecasting right now on Wednesday. We want to wish happy birthday to Richard. He's watching from Breezeport tonight. So Richard, here's your customized forecast for Breezeport. Six below is what we're forecasting with the scattered clouds. But again, hang in there. Warmer temperatures just around the corner. And it's not just one day we're forecasting warmer conditions. It looks like several days in a row, fingers crossed, <laughs> that we're going to see those nice uh, milder readings for next week. 48. I need one pair of socks now. I don't need three. And maybe some shorts. S shorts, some right? sunscreen. T-shirt. I'm going to be out having a good time. Be enjoying. And most of that time frame, too, will be dry as well. So a bonus. All right. I'm very excited. Thank you so much, okay. Joe.